we've got loads of stuff. Shut up! Loads of stuff here. This is my stuff. This is right, this is in the video. This is in the video, so I'm serious. This is the intro now. Well, this is the intro, so we'll see who's laughing in a few days. Good morning and welcome to another video and I'm foraging in a forest because it's just one of the things I've started doing. I'm like a little bit like Robin Hood but instead of stealing money from the rich and giving it to the poor I just put my head in like a tree and then just like look at the leaves and sometimes I lick them but um, <laughs> that's disgusting. I'm never doing that again. Um, yeah so it is a weekday and it's in the morning. What the hell is happening? The answer to that question is that I'm off school. Summer holiday, thank you very much. I'll film whenever the hell I want. Uh, so, I haven't really got a plan for today um, as such. I'm just gonna film a bit and then when I get bored I'll probably stop filming. Uh, I'm stood in my back area uh, right now. I'm gonna go into the kitchen because it's actually hurting my eyes because it's so freaking sunny. The weather's awesome, uh, which is good because it sucked the last few days. Um, I'm feeling pretty good now. Like I, obviously the video on Tuesday, the, the steroids uh, video, I am feeling better than I was at that time. Uh, stomach is still not 100%. I'm still getting kind of the odd stomach ache, but everything else in terms of down below is working good. I'm eating normal, I've been eating normally for the last day and a half, so that's good. Uh, today I'm just gonna continue that uh, progression. And then remember what I said if you watched the video, if you didn't watch the video on Tuesday, go and watch it now. Uh, but remember at the start of that video, I specifically requested uh, likes if you would like to see a particular video. Now, if you know what I'm talking about, um, then give this video a like. Tell me you wanna see that particular video, eh? And then I'll make it happen. Um, so, uh, I've got a train today, I've got to do some bench press, uh, which will be my second session back since my illness, which will be nice to get in there and get it done. I'm not holding out much hope because I know that uh, when you are ill, when, when you lose a bit of weight, bench press tends to take a hit, so you know, fingers crossed it will be alright. Um, before I do that though, we're going to go to the beach, because we live right next to the beach, and we're going to have some bacon sandwiches. So, let's put the bread in the oven, and that is not... A euphemism. Um, and when that's good to go, we're going to go up on the beach. Uh, my sister-in-law and my sister-in-law's partner, my partner-in-law, my partner-in-law, that sounds weird. Uh, we're going to go and hang with those guys and have some bacon sandwiches. I'm also, for the first time ever, going to show you my morning supplement consumption live. So if you don't know what these are, then you need to follow me on Instagram because I showed them the other day. But I'll tell you now because I'm a nice guy. That is Omega-3, some kind of fish oil variant. That is an alpha male which has got all kinds of alpha-ish male type stuff in it like bull semen and dead rhino. And then that is glucosamine which is just white and it looks quite nice. And so, this is how you do it. You get some water in your mouth. Right, these are all good, but uh, this one in particular, if you get it like caught on your throat, it absolutely tastes vile and it makes you want to vomit. Um, so make sure you don't do that. Uh, okay, so get the bread out, get on the beach, see you in a second. I'm going to show you this. These bloody idiots trying to gate crash my video. Shut up! We've got loads of stuff. Shut up! Loads of stuff here. This is my stuff. Right, this is in the video. This is in the video, so... I'm serious. This is the intro now. Well, this is the intro, so... We'll see who's laughing in a few days. Right, we've got loads of stuff here. Most of this is... Right, I'm going to throw you in the sea in a second. That's what I thought. We've got loads of random crap here. Most of this I did bring for the thumbnail, which made you click on it. Suckers! Um, but in terms of what we're actually gonna eat, we're gonna eat 
some bread in there with some bacon which hopefully you've brought which is in there somewhere let's get it ready right i've come home to give you a quick breakfast summary because it's quite windy on the beach so it's hard to hear me talk uh so that was somewhat of an extravaganza in the breakfast uh, department i had um a banana i actually had two bananas so no biggie um uh, one of which was quite brown but i made myself eat it on principle uh, then I had uh, a bacon sandwich, quite a big one. It was really, really good to be. I'm not, a, I'm very much a cereal for breakfast man. So like having other stuff is quite weird, but it's relatively late. It's like half ten. So breakfast uh, with ketchup, a bacon and ketchup sandwich is pretty much bang on. I had some strawberries, a bit of melon, and then I finished it off with some crunchy nut cornflakes, just dry because that's the kind of guy I am. Um, uh, and they're really good. Yeah. So um, I'm now back at home. I'm having my uh, hot pro coconut if you don't know what that is then watch more of my videos and you will discover the incredible secrets uh pretty much i would say or go as far as to say basically the best bulking like liquid form products you're going to get honestly it's really really good anyway um, i'm going to have this go to the toilet i don't know why i told you that and then i'm going to go to the gym i've got um i'm going to do touch and go bench press uh, three plates see how it goes. I'm not like I said I'm, I know I've lost a bit of weight So it might suck, but we'll see what happens if it does suck. I'll just photoshop it and make it look better than it is um, Then a bit of chest and shoulders and triceps. Let's go And that was not too bad, maybe like a seven out of 10. I got um, three plates for five reps, which isn't great, I'll be honest, but um, it's all right considering the fact that I said I'm obviously, I've lost a bit of weight and not feeling, still not feeling completely 100%. Uh, the rest of it was fine. I had to do a bit of a mishmash of two sessions because obviously I missed one. So today was like shoulders, chest and triceps. And I did kind of pick out a few bits from all of it. I did kind of favor the machines because <laughs> just sweating out and I couldn't be asked to do like any free stuff. So I predominantly did the machines. Um, also did a set with the um, 55 kilo dumbbells which are 120 pounds for the first time ever um, and it actually felt alright, I felt quite comfortable, I think I did like 6 or 7 reps and it was more I kept misgrooving it, like the actual weight felt okay, it was moving fairly well but I kept like misgrooving it so after I get my timing down I reckon I'll be getting those for like 10, 12. Anyway, um, I need to go home and pick up stairs and do some fun exciting stuff but before I go I'm gonna have uh, some more protein, so that's 30 grams of chocolate smooth whey, which I'll have with this water. If this inconsiderate person behind me shuts up, uh, my Karen talking, and then I'm gonna have a couple of these bad boys, uh, some mini packs of Haribo, just for the easy cows, the easy carbs, and because quite frankly, they're very, very colorful, so that draw, drew me into them. Back for training, and before I make lunch, Look what I picked up, baby. This was delivered to work. Thank you very much. Let's crack it open and see what's within. Ta -da! So I'll give you a really quick overview. Uh, nothing, mm, well this is all standard stuff. So it's like lean mints, all the uh, burgers and stuff. Sausages, prawns, I freaking love prawns. More burgers, various meat options. Some Norwegian Jarlsberg cheese. Uh, Steak burgers, some asparagus, loads of other meat, just freaking loads of meat. The greatest cheese known to man when grilled. And then, the most exciting part, by far, OMG. I'm gonna try one of these in a minute, because I've never tried one, and I mean, if it's anything like a Snickers, it's got 18 grams of protein. This could be the greatest discovery of my life. But before I 
do that. Uh, I'm going to have some lunch because I'm hungry. So we just grabbed some bread from Sainsbury's. I'm going to combine it with some of these. I call them eggs. I've heard some people call them eggs. I heard someone the other day say eggs. Um, but yeah, I'm going to have some of those in some of this with some of... Where's our ketchup gone? There it is. Um, and then we'll see what happens. Pro egg sandwich tip. Break the yolk up. And then it doesn't go... What? Don't interfere in my cooking. Know your place. Although, I mean, your place is in my cooking, so... Um, yeah, you do that, and then when you cut it up in the sandwich, it doesn't just explode everywhere, which is the most annoying thing in the world. Jurassic Park theme tune, no biggie. Um, so, this is a double egg extravaganza as I call it, uh, aka four bits of bread, four, I think it's four eggs, three or four eggs, I've forgotten now, and then uh, an abundance of ketchup. And I'm going to eat it by picking it up and putting it in my mouth. It's just a little skill that I've uh, nurtured over the course of my life. That's a good sandwich. It's always better when, mm, when you buy that fresh bread, it always makes it way better. Also, harping back to the muscle food stuff, um, if you want to get some, use the link in my uh, description. I'm not going to push it on you, but it is really, really good. Like, if you want to, if you go out and buy your meat each week, and you're buying like you know six sausages, a couple of packs of chicken breasts, whatever, um, that uh, that cost adds up. Whereas you can just do one big order each month from Muscle Foods, stick it all in your freezer, and then get it out as and when you need it. it saves you a lot of time, saves you a lot of money. Um, I also have a lot of squash because I'm still in like drink as much as I possibly can mode to make sure I'm as hydrated as possible I'm off the back of the illness um, because it's really hot. The egg sandwich is done, that's in the past. Now, as Morgan Freeman once famously said in the Shawshank Redemption, let's eat a Snickers protein bar. Okay, Morgan, no worries. Um, here we go. I've taken the liberty of opening it because I cannot do it with one hand whilst filming. Let's get it out. Down I'll be honest, I'm very excited to try this. Um, I'm scared it might be bad and then I'm going to be really disappointed, but I think in life it's best to get your hopes up ridiculously high uh, just on the off, off chance that it might pay off. Very chewy. That's the like cross section of it. BTW. Mm. I mean, that is pretty good to be fair. When I first bit it, I was a bit like, oh, because in my head, in my uh, naivety, I was expecting it to be just like a Snickers bar. It's not. It still has that, you know, that chewy consistency of a protein bar. But to be fair, it is actually pretty good. It basically. It's almost like I've taken the top section of a Snickers and then just whacked like a protein bar underneath it. Um, that is pretty good. I mean, if you were, I always think that I'm not very good at judging these things because I can eat loads and loads of crap, you know what I mean? But if I was like a, a bodybuilder and I was restricting my diet and you know, I couldn't eat hardly anything, I imagine you'd probably be absolutely loving that. I mean, I'm not a big fan of protein bars, but I'm gonna put it out there now and say this is probably the best protein bar I've ever had, so. That is pretty good, definitely recommend it. I also want to try, they've got like Mars protein bars, I'm definitely going to grab some of those and try those as well. Um, yes! Now, I'm going to finish that, and then I'm going to have a shower. In fact, I might even finish it in the shower, and just be all like, But I'm not going to film that because it'll get flagged straight away. Um, I'm going to end the video here guys, because I feel like it's been quite long already, and I've got exciting, not exciting, I've got stuff to do later on. And I can't even bother to film, quite frankly. So you have to wait until Sunday for a full day. Uh, and remember what I said at the start. If you want that full day to be a food challenge, give this video a like. And that will increase the chance of it happening. Um, so, uh, enjoy the rest of your day and your life if I never see you again. Watch out for traffic on main roads because it's dangerous. And I will see you tomorrow.